Hi, everybody. Ryan Ritchie with you from the digitallifestyle.tv. Got an iPhone here. You know what that means. It's time for another iPhone app review. Today, we're taking a look at the game Caster. So in Caster, you play a character who's walking from place to place, and uh, you're casting... So I guess you could say casting spells, but you're using different powers on uh, various enemies as you try to collect different orbs and uh, different power levels. So let's go ahead and start here with a new game to show you what this looks like. If you, uh, let's go with Ethan, that's the default, and we'll go over my saved game. Uh, just because I want to show you a little bit of how you start. Now, you'll notice I'm into a map here. This is when I got a little concerned because I thought, well, wait a minute, I have no idea what to do in the game. But the first mission is a tutorial. So if we go ahead and tap on that little button there, we'll go ahead and go through the first run. Now, the first run, you'll get a feel for the game, obviously. And the thing that's a little bit different and takes a little getting used to is the way you control your character on screen. Okay, so in this mission, basically, you're going to see uh, a grid work. kind of reminds me a little bit of Tron, and the mission director will explain what you're trying to do. So here you are. This is your person right here, and you're going to move around using the left side of the screen to move up and down. Now, the cool thing here is the right side of the screen affects your perspective. So even though you look tiny there, you can go down and uh, get this nice almost first person look here. And so this is all happening uh, very smoothly. The graphics on this are great. Now in this little training mission, we're just on this uh, grid here. But I'll show you in a minute what it looks like when you're out in the real missions. And that'll give you a better idea of what the graphics look like and what it's like when you move around on the game. Okay, so here we are on the first regular mission after the training mission. Down in the bottom right, you can see your radar. The red dots indicate enemies, things you'd rather avoid. And the pulsing dots there are the energy orbs that we're trying to get uh, in this particular level. So I'm going to go down towards one of these, and you can double tap to dash, which makes you go faster. And so there's the orb. I'll grab it just like that. And again, to give you an idea of how the graphics are here, uh, while I'm running, I'm just going to pull down on the other side, and you can see that now I have uh, this perspective. And it's amazing to me that even on a first-gen iPhone, uh, you can do all of this without any kind of lag or anything like that. Now, I have to tell you, Caster, the kind of game it is where you're you know, using different powers and everything against enemies, it's not really my cup of tea, but I can definitely see how if you're into this kind of game, that uh, this is a really good execution of it for the iPhone and iPod Touch. And if you want to just give it a shot, there's also a light version of it available for free as well. For the TheDigitalLifestyle.tv, I'm Ryan Ritchie. Don't forget you can follow us on Twitter at TDL Live.